Hi, this is Simon, and welcome to another marvelous video. We'll be exploring the curious case of Bat Zaro, the world's worst detective. It is kind of weird that someone who would dub themselves with such a moniker, but Bat Zaro is a goodie bag filled with weirdness. Bat Zaro is a dark reflection of Batman with a mangled sense of justice and a twisted moral code. Someone who could be called as the opposite of Batman. Bat Zaro's origins is shrouded in mystery. So join us as we try to unravel the secrets of Bat Zaro's past and explore his unique powers and abilities. Whether you're a fan of the comics or just curious about this fascinating character, this video is sure to provide a thrilling and insightful look into the world of Bat Zaro. Who knows, you might just find yourself rooting for the world's worst detective. The Origin of Bat Zaro The mysterious character that makes an appearance in Superman Batman Volume 1, Issue 20, titled With a Vengeance, Part 1, Here Comes the Maximums, Bat Zaro is a character from the DC Comics universe who is the opposite of Batman in many ways. Unlike Batman, who fights crime and protects the innocent, Bat Zaro uses dual pistols to gun down couples in Crime Alley, the very place where Batman's parents were killed. Bat Zaro's origin story is the opposite of Batman's, which makes him an intriguing and unique character in his own right. Despite his violent tendencies, Bat Zaro is not entirely without redeeming qualities. He claims to have come from the same place as Bizarro, the opposite version of Superman, and he idolizes Batman as a hero. When Bizarro offers to team up with him, Bat Zaro agrees, and the two shake hands. However, Bat Zaro reveals that he has a blue kryptonite shard that he found after a meteor shower, which causes is Bizarro to fly away, weakened, and return to his normal state. Even though they are different, there are times when it seems as though Batzaro is trying to help Batman. However, his unintelligible way of speaking and baffling actions makes it difficult to be sure. It was later shown that the Joker actually created Batzaro using the reality-altering powers he obtained from Mr. Mitsopedalik, so that he could have the pleasure of killing a version of Batman, which explains his violent tendencies and his reverse origin story. Does he really die after that incident? The fate of Batzaro in the DC Comics universe is somewhat ambiguous. According to his storyline, Batzaro apparently died the moment he jumped in front of a bullet that was shot by the Joker in order to save Batman's life, who was his idol. This heroic act suggests that Batzaro may have redeemed himself in some way, despite his violent tendencies and questionable morality. However, Batzaro later reappeared in the comics, apparently healed by Bizarro in the Phantom Zone, and he was ready to fight crime once more. In this iteration, he seemed to be more intelligent and competent than before, which suggests that his time in the Phantom Zone may have had a positive effect on him. Even after his apparent redemption, Bizarro still disapproves of Batzaro's method and calls him not Bruce. This suggests that there may be still some lingering doubts about Batzaro's true intentions and whether or not he can truly be trusted as a crime fighter. Member of Team Penguin against Team Harley Quinn. Batzaro makes an appearance in a story that is as goofy as he is. In the Angry Bird storyline of the Harley Quinn comics, Batzaro is seen as a member of the Penguin's team of supervillains. His teammates include Lark, a loyal henchman of the Penguin, Morris, another one of the Penguin's henchmen, Pierre, the third member of the Penguin's core henchmen, Amy Kadala, a monstrous villain with incredible strength and endurance, Beast, a hulking brute with immense strength and durability, Black Spider, a skilled assassin and vigilante, Colonel Blimp, a former military officer turned criminal mastermind, Crazy Quilt, a colorful and flamboyant villain, Firefly, a pyromaniacal villain with a love of setting things on fire, Mad Hatter, a deranged and unpredictable villain obsessed with mind control. Riddler, a master of puzzles and riddles. Scarecrow, a villain with the ability to induce fear in his victims. Solomon Grundy, a zombie-like villain with superior strength and durability. And Ten-Eyed Man, a former soldier with the ability to see through his fingertips. Penguin and his band of villains were up against Harley Quinn and a team of villains in an intense battle, which ended up on Penguin and his team losing. Batzaro's opposing team led by Harley Quinn consisted of Big Tony, a powerful and intimidating crime boss, the Brooklyn Bruisers, a gang of tough and violent thugs from Brooklyn, Tanya Tank, a powerful and heavily armored villain, Captain Horatio Strong, a pirate-themed villain with a love of treasure and plunder, Catwoman, a skilled thief and occasional ally to Batman, 
Egg Fu, a bizarre and enigmatic villain with a shape-shifting egg-shaped body. Frank Frank, a villain with the ability to control machinery and technology. Gang of Harleys, a group of villains who were inspired by Harley Quinn. Killer Croc, a reptilian villain with incredible strength. Poison Ivy, a villain with the ability to control plant life and use pheromones to manipulate others. Power Girl, a Kryptonian hero who turned into a villain. Red Tool, a villain with a love of gadgets and technology. Cyborgman, a cyborg villain with a love of technology and gadgets. And Ventriloquist, a villain with the ability to control a dummy through ventriloquism. Batzaro's powers and abilities. The self-styled world's worst detective, Batzaro's biggest ability is his marksmanship. He's an expert with dual pistols and he's able to take down his targets with deadly accuracy. This skill is often used to gun down people in the city of Gotham. Batzaro also possesses a certain degree of superhuman strength and durability, which allows him to take on opponents who are much larger and stronger than him. He is able to withstand physical attacks and can dish out significant damage with his fists and weapons. Weapons. Another unique ability that Batzaro possesses is his ability to speak in Bizarro speak, a distorted and backward form of English that is often difficult for others to understand. This language adds to his overall unpredictability and makes it difficult for other characters to anticipate his actions. Batzaro possesses some sort of agility and acrobatic skill, which allows him to move quickly and dodge attacks with ease. This skill comes in handy during combat situations and allows him to stay one step ahead of his opponent. Is there any difference between Batzaro and Bizarro Batman? The answer to that would be yes. The characters Batzaro and Bizarro Batman may sound similar, but they are two entirely different characters. The most obvious difference between Batzaro and Bizarro Batman is their respective origins. Batzaro is a character who was created by the Joker as a twisted version of Batman, with a reverse origin story and violent tendencies. On the other hand, Bizarro Batman is a version of Batman from another world, where he is a villain, with many of the same same skills and abilities as the real Batman. Another important difference between the two characters is their motivations and goals. Batzaro is often portrayed as a violent and unpredictable character with a desire to cause chaos and destruction. He uses dual pistols to gun down couples in Crime Alley, the very place where Batman's parents were killed. Bizarro Batman, on the other hand, is more of a traditional villain with a desire to defeat his heroic counterpart and take over Gotham City. In terms of personality, Batzaro and Bizarro Batman are also quite different. Batzaro is often depicted as a tragic figure with a desire to be a hero like his idol Batman but lacking the moral compass and self-control to do so. He is often driven by his emotions and impulses which leads to violent outbursts and unpredictable behavior. Bizarro Batman on the other hand is more cold and calculating with a single-minded determination to defeat his heroic counterpart and achieve his goals. While both characters are essentially villains their abilities and powers are also quite different. Batzaro Bizarro uses dual pistols to gun down his victims, while Bizarro Batman possesses many of the same skills and gadgets as the real Batman, but with a violent twist. He uses his gadgets to cause chaos and destruction rather than to fight crime. Marvelous verdict. Well, there you have it, folks. Batzaro may be the world's worst detective, but he sure is interesting nonetheless. From his quirky speech to his crazy behavior, everything screams cuckoo at you. But does he not grow on you as the time passes by? Well, that's up to you to decide whether you love him or hate him. There is no denying that Batzaro is one of a kind. So, thank you for joining us on this journey into the wacky world of Batzaro. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos exploring the crazy and colorful world of superheroes and villains. You never know what strange and mysterious characters we will explore next.